Elgio Marakwet County. The University of Nairobi, through the Kavi Institute for Clinical Research, together with a consortium of African universities and research institutions, has initiated the Sisulu Foundation for African and Pandemic Disease Response. The foundation, led by Walter Sisulu University from South Africa, is set to establish a collaborative pan-African platform for training, research and development in pandemics. Speaking during the launch, Acting Director General of Health, Dr. Patrick Moth said the foundation will enable Africans to develop their own COVID-19 vaccines as well as combat other diseases and pandemics in future. Evidence suggests that the likelihood of pandemics has increased over the past century because of increased global travel, integration, urbanization, uh, and other changes in land use and to a greater exploitation of the natural environment. These trends will likely continue and will intensify. When India reported uh, the surge in number of cases, uh, and because our vaccine was manufactured in uh, India through the Serum Institute of India, then the entire vaccination process in the African continent came to a halt. What does that mean? The West continued with its vaccination program going ahead to be able to vaccinate a large proportion of their population, including young people. So you can be able to see the inequity. These are some of the hard lessons that the pandemic has taught us. And it has, uh, out of this, we have decided to come together as one continent to be able to develop local solutions for our problems. Because anyhow, any country will still take care of its people first before they think of their neighbors. The Kenya National Union of Teachers, NAT, head office has been closed indefinitely.